Yeah. I got time for one more. Lee from Middlesex. How you doing? Hey, Lee, out there? I've always wanted to say this. Uh, you got to turn your radio down. <laughs> okay, I think I might have lost Lee. All right, you know, I know what Lee was asking about, though. Um, he was asking, what happens if a tenant doesn't pay their rent? Very good question. I wish I had asked Alex this. The best way to, to, to improve your chances of getting paid rent is to do good checks of your tenants in the first place, okay? Buy property in places that have good school systems because people who have kids want to move to places where the kids are going to be in a good school system. You tend to have more responsible tenants in those situations. Do the Google search on them. Do the You know, you can't do a, an official background check, but you will want to run their credit. You're going to have to work with a real estate company who has credit check ability. You get the authorization to do that. Run their credit. If they're paying their bills on time, they have good credit, think of it as you're loaning them money, Okay. Screening your tenants is critical. I'm knocking on wood right now because I've got great tenants in my properties, and I rarely have a problem collecting rent. Um, when you do have a problem collecting rent, you basically have to go through an eviction process, which is painful, and which is one of the reasons why we like putting very big down payments down. Because if you do get stuck making your mortgage payment for a few months while you have to get rid of a tenant and change out uh, the tenancy, you don't want to have the bill be any bigger than it has to be. So that is one of the risks in investing in real estate, which is why you do your homework up front, make sure you're buying in the right kind of place, and then you're renting it out to the right kind of people that, uh, that pay their bills. All right? Okay, no, no more time for any more calls. So I'll tell you a couple other things, and then we'll wrap it up. Um, my website, ownamerica.com. Please go there. Check it out. Go to the blog. Register for the newsletter and sign up for that free class because it's going to be going, going, gone by Friday. You're going to have to pay for it from that point forward. Also, get a copy of my book, Crash Boom. I'm sincere when I tell you that if you learn this, you've got knowledge that's going to help you secure your financial future in a way that nothing on Wall Street ever could. So get out there and do it. If you want to learn more about Jacksonville Wealth Builders, they have a really cool uh, investor kit they'll send you for free, which includes a DVD that's very educational. Go to JacksonvilleWealthBuilders.com or call 904-677-6777. They're sponsoring this show, but I can tell you that uh, I myself am going through the process of converting my IRA into a self-directed IRA, and I'm buying a house from Jacksonville Wealth Builders, and the process has been nothing short of of a a pleasure. Um, They don't sell, they educate, and uh, you'll be happy you did. Thanks for listening. This is Rand on Real Estate. I'm Greg Rand, and we are done.